everybody and welcome to Race City Marine. Today you join me out on the lake on one of our pre-owned boats. This is our 2014 Malibu Wake Setter 24 MXZ. If you have any questions on this Wake Setter or like to schedule a test drive and take it out on the water for yourself, check out all of our contact information down in the description below. So the boat we're on today is 24 and a half feet long, finished off in a really nice dark gray exterior gel coating, has a really cool look all around. Moving to the interior, you're gonna see that same gray color for the interior hull, as well as all the carpeting. And then we have an off-white cream color for all the vinyl, really nice condition. And it weighs in at 4,800 pounds and can seat 18 people. At the stern of the boat, we have a really large swim platform back here with a non-slip surface. It even curves down towards water to make it a little bit easier to enter and exit the boat when you and your friends and family are having some fun in the water. There's a grab handle on the back of the hull with a tow hook. And then underneath the platform, you'll see Malibu's surf gate as well as the power wedge to throw a crazy wave for surfing or wakeboarding really cool to see all that technology underneath the swim platform we also have the transom mounted remote to control your audio system and then as you can see we have a cool set of seats back here you can lounge out back here and just enjoy hanging out on the water both of these seats are on hinges and you can lift them up and you can see some of the storage space in here as well as the back side a part of the ballast system we also have a cup holder on each side and a nice non slip surface right here to help you enter and exit the boat. Take a look at some of the storage in this boat. We have two cushions that'll open up on hinges. We have gas struts as well, so they can assist as you open them up. And there's also a removable storage tray right in the center. And we have your ski pylon. You can pull this out and lock it into place if you do want to be tubing or skiing. And of course we have the tower for more of the wakeboard style activities. So with this tray out, you can see the engine underneath it. We have the Inmar six liter Monsoon V8 engine pumping out 410 horsepower. That's gonna be plenty of power to get this boat up on plane, even with the fully weighted ballast. On each of these side lockers, we have a lot of dry storage space, and you can see the addition to the hard ballast tanks with these bags on each corner. And then now inside the wake center, you can see just how much seating we have. Great place to lounge out when you're hanging out on the lake with everybody. This center cushion right in the back flips forward, and there's a little bit of storage back here, which is a cool little touch. You're also going to notice that each of these corner cushions are both removable, and when you take them out, it gives you better access to see the part of the ballast bag as well as additional storage. Being a 24-foot boat, of course, you have a lot of space in here. These two seats are also on gas struts with a hinge, and they open up for even more storage space, which is a really cool touch. And then one of my favorite parts about this boat is the rearward-facing seats. This cushion right here is actually on a hinge. It'll lock into place to have a really good lounge area to catch all the action behind the boat. And you have a mirror seat on the other side that'll lock up to have two seats to do that. And of course, when you take a look at the actual passenger seat, you can fit probably two people in here and then four people can comfortably face all the action behind you. These are on metal hinges as well and you can easily unhook them to lower them back down. The backrest for the passenger seat, you can also lift up to gain some extra access and remove the lower cushion to see all the storage space we have. We have your dual battery system and a lot of your audio components and plenty of space for anything that you need. We also have your glove box over on this side and then we have your helm seat. There is a lever you can pull to swivel this outwards and there's an adjustable bolster. If you need a little bit extra height, you can pull that up, which is a really cool touch. If we go ahead and hop inside the seat now, we have a nice armrest over here with more of that gray vinyl and your throttle is in easy reach with a top unlock button. We have a really cool looking steering wheel with just a central spoke. And then if we turn the ignition on to turn all the electronics on, we can see your radio head unit to the left and then a touchscreen system is gonna turn on to the right side. You can adjust the surf gate as well as check out your engine parameters and deploy your power wedge and adjust some of your lights. And then up top here, we have your tachometer as well as the hours. Over on the left, we have a speedometer, your depth finder, and a few other vitals. And then another LCD screen in the center. You can see exactly how your center plate's doing, more of the wake settings, your cruise control. You have presets for your different rider profiles that you can adjust. You can also tap into your gauges and see more of the vitals within the boat. And then tapping your setup, you can go into pretty much anything on the screen, which is a really nice touch to see. And then moving to the bow of this bow, you're gonna notice this is a huge bow. We have a bow filler cushion and just so much space to really lounge out and enjoy it. We have some cup holders on each side and grab handles as well as the speakers. And then what I really like on each side, the backrests will pull up and there's more storage space on the back, which is really cool. You can add a few more smaller items back here. And then just like that, the front cushion, the backrest will open up as well and you can fit an anchor in there or a little bit more storage. 
And then this boat has a very wide front bow, as you can see, so you can easily enter and exit. We also have a handle to lift open this door with an integrated ladder to make it easy to enter and exit in the water. And then moving to the tower and bimini top, this has a really huge bimini to really shade the interior. And there's even pockets with a mesh underside so you can fit some wet ropes or something in there. Nice convenient touch. We have four tower speakers, two on each side that are mounted, all finished in a really nice black coating. And then we have a set of swivel board racks. You can easily pull this pin and swivel the board rack inside to load and unload your boards. It's lined in rubber so you don't get any marks on your board. And we have some nice bungee cords to safely secure them. The bending top of course folds away and then we have your tow hook on top. So there's a good look at our 2014 Malibu Wake Setter 24MXZ. This is a really nice pre-owned boat. If you have any questions on it or would like to schedule a test drive and take it out on the water for yourself, check out all of our contact information in the description below. We look forward to seeing you all out on the water.